Why is this not broadcasting? Damn it. Hello. Ah, I got it. What's up, friends? I'm here. What are you talking about? Hurry up. You can see me now. I'm, uh, dude, before the Cowboy game. I'm doing it before the Cowboy game. Cowboy game is happening shortly, but I'm here. This is not going to be a crazy long review action thingy bobber. Can you guys hear me okay? Ooh, 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 wire, wire and stuff. What is going on, friends? My name is Stan, and we are here to do a little bit of a review for the Galdria Bolt RDA. Boom! Galdria Bolt, the Bolt. I'm live, Big Red, I'm live. You got me now? Loud and clear, not too loud, right? I do get loud. You know, you guys know that I get a little bit excited and I am like yelling and stuff. Yoshi's giving me the dirty eye, the stink eye right now. I can't show Yoshi, but he is. He's giving me the stink eye. Very cool. How many people we got in here? Let's see. We got five. We've got five. You guys are hard pressed for a giveaway if we don't get a hundred in here. Um, everybody like the review right now? Poor favor. Oh, sweet. Six already. There we go. You guys rock, man. You guys are on top of it. All right. Let's check it out. You guys are here with me to review the Bolt by Godria. And uh, there's the box again one more time. The Bolt by Godria. Uh, you guys have probably seen this around on, on uh, Instagram by now. That's not going to focus. Oh, well. I have a video for an unboxing, I call it the quick look, for the Godria Bolt, and you guys can, frozen on you, sorry Ryan, you guys can check that out, give it a thumbs up, say what up, I saw you live about this thing, this is the full review, we're not going to take too long with it, because I already went over the whole thing, that's why we're doing this live, no close ups, no nothing like that, um, hey Stan, what have you been vaping, we're going to start with that, because I like it. So first and foremost, we've been, oh wait, hold on. I've been vaping this Stentorian Ram in the black. Thanks, bro. I'm glad you like my hat. Here, you know what? Before I get into all that, let's do some shout outs. Let's do some shout outs. Bunch of my uh, very awesome Instagram followers are in here. Eric the Champ. What's up, Eric the Champ? Just a vapor addict. What's going on, man? Y'all know Justin Vapor Addict. Big Red Vapes. Go check out his uh, his and Justin Vapor Addict's channel on YouTube. Uh, who else is in here? Chrome73. You don't see anything. Well, keep checking, bro. Um, XX Texas Zombies in here. What's up, Mr. Hall? Mr. Hall's in the house. Chris Hall, 87, I think it is. Um, hey, Tank Sauce Marissa. What is it? Silent Silhouette from Instagram. Kangi. Kangi Vapes. All right, guys. You won't hurt my feeling. You won't hurt my feelings if uh, you guys run out and uh, do a post on Instagram telling everybody to get their butts in here real quick. <laughs> so what have we been vaping? I've been vaping the I'm showing my microphone like it sees this. I've been vaping the Stentorian Ram Squonk Box. And uh, this is my the one from Drip Factory Labs, the one squonk bottle. And what we do is we squeeze here, we turn this upside down, and I bet you guys all know what's in this. I bet you all know what's in this. The bottle's over there. This is not it, but it's tank sauce, pear ball. Got a little air, flip it back over. Squonk the air out, flip it back over, fill her up. Yeah, buddy. This bolt will be absolutely fun on one of your series boxes, Heretic. I'm giving it away, but this bolt would be fantastic on your series box. Well, we'll talk about it. We're going to talk about it right now. 
Give me a second. Why won't it work, Marissa says. All right, and on this Stentorian Ram, I'm rocking that Pulse 24 with a gold flake drip tip because it just looks so dang sexy. There's there's so much there's so much sexy in here. Y'all see all that with a pair a pair of own face killer point one aliens. My wife is home, so my dogs are going eight shit. Oh well, it's not gonna focus, but let me squonk it. Squonk. Let me fire it. Fire. Oh, yeah. I'm dropping shit because that's what I do. It wouldn't be anything that Stan did if he didn't do something. I dropped my Double Helix Designs drip tip at the benefit last weekend because I was under the influence slightly. But I broke it, and it's gone forever now. That made me sad. It was a recoil drip tip. Who else is joining us? Chris Fuentes. What's up, Chris Fuentes? And the Heretic Vapors in the house. Also, what I've been vaping on is I've been vaping on my Purple Druga. That does not have a mark on it. That was cotton. My Purple Druga with my Chuff Art drip tip. This is the Wizard Mist by Chuff Art. Yeah, buddy. And then I've had my broadside custom painted by Mozilla on Instagram. And I'm not going to show this label because I don't want to get fried for it. Um, I was given this juice by Mean John Green himself, the man, the mystery. And it is Geronimo by, it says FJZ Liquid. I'm assuming that's, yeah, FJZ Liquid. I'm not going to say what that is. Uh, supposed to say i think what it's supposed to say but uh chironimo it is a churro and it is freaking amazing oh my gosh it's so 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 good um it's so good. They just got to fix that label. That label can't happen um, because the Legion and all those other guys are going to get down on you real hard. Unfortunately, that's how it works today. Um, Sing 311. No. <laughs> I've got one of the DHD bat tips coming in tomorrow. That's awesome. The DHD bat tips, for y'all that don't know, is a color changing drip tip by Double Helix Designs that is either white or black. And then when it heats up, it changes color and reveals bats. It's pretty awesome for Halloween, I guess. It does not look like the mage you passed up. You know why? Because this is fantastic looking and the mage doesn't look this good. What's up, everybody? All right, guys. So what else I've been vaping on? I've been vaping the Recoil Rebel. That's juicy. The Recoil Rebel. And on the Recoil Rebel, I stuck a set of... Oh, another set of... Fused uh, aliens, fused aliens, set of aliens by Own Face Killer. And that is on my Purge truck, 2700 mod. Boom. And you know what? Juice I've been vaping with that is around here somewhere. Is a juice that I made and I put up on Instagram yesterday. My strawberry surprise. Basically, I took every strawberry juice that I had 10 mils of left in a 120 bottle. And I just mixed them all up and that was it. Now, let me tell you, if you do that, it can be terrible or it can be awesome. Fortunately, it turned out awesome. The reason why it turned out awesome was because Jam Monster overtakes absolutely everything, and it made this taste like Jam Monster. So basically, I gave myself another 60 mils of Jam Monster. It's a little smoother. Then the Jam Monster. The Jam Monster has that little tinge at the back of it, like a little kick to it. But it's got all that sweetness, and it smoothed it out just a little bit. I think what did it was the Rogue Milk Mint, Milk Mint, Milk Bomb that I put in there. Last, but certainly not least. Actually, there's two more things I've been vaping on. Y'all ready? Boom! This right here with some Cloudberry by uh, Cloudy Vapory, Cloud Vapory. It's got one of those soft De one squonk bottles in it and the Pulse 22 on it, 
with a DHD drip tip. This one survived last weekend. When I drink, I drop stuff. And uh, this thing's rocking and rolling on a Lazy Vapors parallel, parallel squonk mod. Woo, doggy. This thing. And y'all know I can't let you go without one more thing. One more thing that I'm going to put some of this uh, strawberry surprise on that I made. And uh, unfortunately, I can't show it to you <laughs> yet. But the reveal is coming very, very soon. Um, we got on our Hooligan Parallel Mod. If you're just lucky enough, you might be able to pause that crazy thing I did on live right there and uh, see what it looks like. This is the Lucid by Stan and Tenacious TX Vapes himself, all under Tenacious Trade Co. LLC. But it's cloudy. It is quiet. I think it's quiet. Oh, well, it's loud because I haven't put my hand around it. But it is quiet, I promise. Justin Vapor Addict is on the test group, and he can vouch for how quiet this thing is. It's also amazing to build on. I love it. And, uh, I mean, I may be biased, but, yeah, I love it. You're going to want one. Keep an eye out. I should be having these things in my hands by the end of September. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Where do you get that rogue liquid from? You can never find any. You know what, Chris Fuentes? Hit me up on Instagram, Tenacious TX Vapes. Send me a DM and I'll send you a link. How about that? All right. So we have gone through what we've been vaping. Let's get down and dirty with the Godria Volt. Who's seen this thing? Have you guys seen this thing yet? Oh, hell. I'm doing a review and I don't even have it in front of me. I'm such a jackass. Where did it go? Oh, God. Hold on, guys. <laughs> oh man, I'm an idiot. Woohoo! Hey guys, you know what? I'm back. Isn't that awesome? Check it out. <laughs> this is the Goldria Bolt. And you know what? I wasn't very fond of the drip tip they had on there. So I stuck on my own. I stuck on my own knurled drip tip that I got out of one of the Vandy Vape packages. I know, right? Hey, you know what? I'm like super professional. This is just how this goes. So here we go. The Bolt by Goldria. $29.99 currently on Element Vape. The link's in the description. Um, this thing is pretty nice. Let me see here. Let me put it on something so I can show it to you. Here we go. We'll put it on the purge. Because I know I got a build in here is good enough. Okay, in the close ups, I showed you guys. I'm not going to go through a whole bunch of uh, close up action, a whole bunch of any of that. Um, it is a goon style build deck. It's a spring loaded goon style build deck, which I absolutely love. Um, it fits a pretty decent sized build, but it's not huge. It is a 24 millimeter. Is a 24 millimeter, okay, and it's got dual coil airflow as well as single coil airflow. All the etchings and everything on it are pretty hot looking. I mean, this thing's pretty cool looking. It has pretty much the same exact finish on it as the recoil in the black. It's got that matte finish that's really hard coated. Um, I've dropped this thing. <sighs> I drop everything. I drop everything. Build quality, fit and finish, awesome. I mean, everything adjusts nice and easy. Um, the O-rings, they hold, but they don't hold so bad. I got to turn it to get the, the cap on, but they don't hold so bad that I'm fighting with it. Um, this thing is, it's good looking. It's nice and short. Here's the next to the, 
recoil, the Rebel. Okay, here it is next to the Goon 1.5. All right, the Goon 1.5 is a little taller. Um, here it is next to the Pulse 24. Pulse 24 is about the same height. Uh, so it's got that real short profile that gives you really good flavor. Price point is about 30 bucks, $29.99. All right. The shower, that's not a shower curtain, bro. That's my, uh, that's my sheets. They match my jammies. Um, but as far as $30 for this thing with spring-loaded clamps, the clamps are chunkier than a goon. So, you know, you guys know how that goon, you know what? I don't remember what the clamps look like on top of the, the new goon, the 1.5. Let's see. Okay. The clamps on top are about as chunky as the Goon 1.5, if not chunkier. Um, they have a nice bevel on the clamps, so you don't really need it, though, because they're spring-loaded. So I guess if you wanted to take the springs out, you're good. Um, you can still fit the wire in there, and the clamps will move up and down for you. I don't have any issues with conductivity. Uh, it's It comes with a squonk pin, which I haven't used yet, but I will in the near future. I've been rocking this thing on mechs not really squonking it because I just been loving it and uh, I've had two builds on it and I don't ever want to take them out. I just want to keep rocking it the way it is. Uh, as far as series builds, like you were talking about heretic, it can fit a bigger build, but it doesn't seem to have the space that other RDAs have. Let's open up that airflow there, killer. It doesn't seem to have the space. And you can see it's probably because of 25 versus a 24. But it's got space. It's just not. This is the Goon and this is the Godria. And the Goon looks a little bit larger inside. And most likely that's just because of the, the diameter. The Goon 1.5, that's a 25, right? Um, but, gosh, I'm a blonde. I can't do two things at once. Talk, fool. So, build quality, fantastic. Really, really, really tight fit and finish. Um, really good finishing. I've dropped the thing a few times. It hasn't chipped or dinged or anything. Um, it looks cool. It's got... Bottom airflow, that is equivalent to the Kennedy, in my opinion. The bottom airflow is fantastic. Um, it also has side airflow. So if you're down with the side airflow, you don't really want to do the bottom airflow, hit that up. Uh, it's, it, I mean, either or, you can back and forth. It's even got the side and the bottom on the single coil option. Uh, it's cheap enough. It's 30 bucks. The Goon is still going about $45, $50. And what else can I say about this thing? It looks good. I mean, it looks good. It works good. It, the only con I have for this thing, okay? The only con I have for this thing, listen up. You ready? Damn it. Open. Why do I keep, I keep playing with the damn top cap? That's just bottom airflow. This is full. I'm not a fan of how loud it is. Um, you get the thing opened up, and it's loud. It sounds like a jet taking off. That is my only con to this thing. But if you can deal with that at the price point, it is an awesome RDA. Um, I would recommend buying one of these over a Goon 1.5 at this point. Now, an OG Goon, oh, I just have a a hard, long, deep love in my heart for the OG Goon. Um, the Goon 1.5 is awesome, but they didn't change it enough for my taste for me to be super excited about it, even though I love it and I still use it. Uh, the quality is there. The Godria is right there, man. The Godria is right there with the quality. Uh, it's right there with the function, and it has bottom airflow. You've got a awesome little RDA with Kennedy airflow, Goon functionality, and the finish of like the recoil products. Dude, that's a win. That's a win. In my opinion, that's a win. It does not whistle. Let's try it. 
Well, I'm close it down halfway. Close it down a little more. It doesn't whistle and it gets quieter as you close it down. However, if you are rocking big bills in this thing like I am, I'm rocking like a 0.1 in there. Um, well, actually, it's not huge. It's a 2.5 millimeter six wrap. Comes out to a 0.1 and it's not humongous, but it gets hot. So if you're rocking something like that and it's got hot and it gets hot on you, you're going to want that airflow opened up and it's just too loud. There's a slight whistle to it, but it's not enough to bother me. What bothers me is what it is. It sounds like a jet engine. So the OG drip tip, man, why don't you go check out my other, my other, uh, I don't have the OG drip tip. I have the 510 drip tip adapter that it came with. It came with a, I'm live on YouTube and my wife is bringing me a Bucky soda because she's amazing. Oh crap, I'm dropping springs and crap everywhere. It comes with extra springs, extra screws, a, uh, a goon, a goon, a squonk pin and extra O-rings. And then it also comes with this little Ultum 510 drip tip adapter, which works well. But all that is gone over in great detail in the quick look. So take a look at the, yeah, where's the 100 viewers? I don't know where the 100 viewers are, man. There's only nine. We've only got nine viewers. You guys got any questions or anything? What? Justin Vapor Addict, I want everybody to, all right, ready? Justin Vapor Addict, everybody get into the chat and just hound Justin Vapor Addict. I want super troll action on Justin Vapor Addict. He is being a troll and I want everybody to troll back at him. I am Butterfingers, but what does that have to do with anything? We have any questions or anything? I had a couple of really, really cool little RDAs to give away if we got 100 viewers, but uh, you guys will have to uh, convince me to give them away now. There's only nine in here. Only nine. That makes me feel sad. Sad deep down in my loins. <laughs> There's Vapor Buck. What's going on? Um, well, if any, if nobody has any questions, we'll close this up. I just wanted to go over the Gaudria real quick. Tell you guys that, in my opinion, it's worth it. Uh, if you're looking for something like the Goon or whatever, go ahead and buy it. Uh, I would definitely. Um, I'm not saying don't buy the Goon because it's fantastic, but if you got 30 bucks to buy an RDA and not 50 bucks, and you want something like right now. Pick that Gaudria up because it really, really, really is. I've been using it for like two or three weeks straight. Since the first look is when I first opened it, and I've been using it every single day since. <laughs> All right, everybody's jacking on him right now. Give everyone something except Justin and laugh at him about it. Football is more important. Football is important, and you know what? Tom Brady, damn you, Tom Brady. My feelings are hurt. What the heck happened? That game, I was just like, whoa, Texans versus Patriots. I couldn't even, oh, man. Why is Tom Brady so good? Him and Bill Belichick, they made a deal with the devil. That's what happened. So we're going to get out of here. How many, how many people do we still have in here? Do we still have everybody in here still? Eight watching. Okay, you guys, there's eight of you watching. I have an Eco RDA and I have a Peerless RDA. So here's what's going to happen. Because I love you guys so much and you guys are the only ones to come in here. I'm going to go ahead and do the giveaway anyway. So all those folks that didn't show up, oh, well, I'm going to give away the Eco. We're giving away the Eco RDA today, the Sig Pet Eco. This is a stainless one. What's up, Ryan? What you got? This is a stainless Eco Sig Pet, Eco Sig Pet, iJoy. Yeah, all the same stuff. And I'm going to give it away to somebody in the chat. I'm going to give it away to the best. 
here's what's going to happen. Yeah, here's what's going to happen. <laughs> I, I am all over the place. I don't do this live thing often. So I'm going to give it away, and I am going to guess a number. Here we go. The Lucid is coming out in a number of finishes. The number is less than four, or it's four or less. That's what I should say. The number of finishes is four or less, all right? I want everybody in the chat to tell me what they think the finishes are going to be. You get one guess. Say all of them, and then whoever gets it right first wins the RDA. Ready? Lucid RDA is coming out. What finishes? Go. And if you have any, uh, any other questions or anything, I'll go ahead and I will answer those as well. And it doesn't have to be about the Godria. Nice, Ryan. Nobody is answering the questions. 10. 10 people in the chat right now. Everybody tell me what finishes they think the, not the number, tell me what finishes you think. Black, brass, and stainless. Nope. Justin's wrong. Justin's disqualified anyway. He can't win stuff on my channel. Hold on, we're looking, we're looking. We got a close one in the chat right now, but nobody's right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Everybody gets another guess. Ready? Go. First one to get the answer. It's coming out in black. I'll tell you that. Give me the other two. Two more. I still don't see it. I still don't see it. You got to say the whole answer, Big Red. You can't just give me one. What's a no? <laughs> All right, black. And stainless. Somebody give me the last one. Ready? Go. If you've said the answer before, this is disqualified. Black and stainless. What's the third one? Come on, guys. This is a long and drawn out process by now. I'm watching. I'm watching. I see black. I see stainless. I see black, red, green. That's not a color. I see gold. Ryan Hershey, Ryan Hershey got the gold, black, stainless, and gold, okay? Ryan Hershey, you're the winner. I'll hook you up with a brand new SigPet Eco RDA. If you got one already, let me know, and I'll give it to somebody else. All right? You guys stay safe. You guys have a fantastic rest of your day. Thank you so much for joining me in this long, drawn-out, squirrel-brained process, and uh, I appreciate it. And remember... Vape on, friends. How you turn this thing off? Here.